we'll see what they can do tonight. The Vipers in red, gray, and white. Santa Cruz in the white. Santa Cruz in Rio Grande Valley. Santa Cruz in at three wins and three losses as Zyslav takes a shot at the end of the shot clock buzzer, but the, the offensive rebound is put back, killed the Vipers last time on the boards as they won 122-112 to 112 in, uh, back on November the 12th. And here come the Warriors again, shot partially blocked. That was Zyslav's shot. And then another loose ball in the lane is put back by Devin Marble. The Warriors, Thornwell inside was trying to feed it off to uh, Ray Spaulding, but couldn't do that. Shot from outside is Marble, and he's good. Uh, Pargo with it, kicks it outside for Zyslav. Zyslav, former Indiana Hoosier, drives left-handed layup is good. Warriors have it at the moment. This is a Pargo out of Gonzaga. He's gonna drive. Left-hand layup is good. Rebound comes to the Vipers. So Jared Vanderbilt, the newest Viper in there, and the follow-up is good by Blossom Game. Jared Vanderbilt playing just his second game as a Viper. Muti Abidias feeds Vanderbilt. His hit in some. And we've got a timeout on the floor right now with 6.29 to play in the first quarter. This will count for one. No good. And score still 13 to eight. Warriors with it, drive inside, Johnson scores. The ball gets passed around, drive inside, Vanderbilt goes up and scores. Since he gets set, he's just going right at it. And he's got six points to show for it. Leading score in the Vipers so far as Cunningham pulls up, 15 footer is good. It sets a high pick for him as they get it to Boykins. Boykins, the three pointer, no good. Johnson the rebound. For a two minute mark of the first quarter, three point effort by Blue, wide open and nailed it. Yeah, they're uh, two of eight right now. And Vanderbilt down to the Warriors. It's Toscano Anderson who picked up the rebound. He'll get into the hands of Reese, left side, three pointer, got it. Time G League champions against the uh, two time G League champion Warriors here tonight. Vanderbilt, three pointer, in and out and back in, wow. Vipers with it, and it is to Spalding, back to Rodriguez. Rodriguez will drive inside the lane, little teardrop will go in. And Angel Rodriguez has four points. Has the ball right now, kicks it out to Blue. Blue drives inside, he'll throw it out with five on the shot clock, a long range shot by Harrison, and that's good. Right over to Blue, guarded by Rodriguez. Now to Reese. Reese trying to drive inside, can't find any space, so Harrison will take a three, and he got it. And two in a row for Harrison, he's got eight. Starting to hit their, their threes right now, they found the range, and uh, that's not good news for the Vipers. Thornwell with a skip pass over here to Blossom Game, and Blossom Game hits the three. And it's a nine point game once again. Harrison lobs it inside for Johnson, who lays it up and in. Nice athletic move there by the big guy from outside. Toscano Anderson tries to dribble behind his back. Didn't realize Spalding was there. And here's Thornwell. Big duck. Former Marquette Golden Eagle against the uh, Louisiana Tech Bulldog. Boykins picks up his dribble. Then the pass stolen away. It's a three on O break. Blue will lay it up and score. Thornwell will come out. Now, uh, Deontay Davis with a nice assist there. Rodriguez into the corner. Gets a screen, drives inside, now finds his way to the basket, and then a tip in there by Spaulding. Finds his way to the right corner. Gets it to Spaulding, driving the hoop. Score! The miss there by Cunningham. Looked pretty, but no cigar. Vipers back with it. Boykins right side, three is good! Quick passing. And Cunningham misses a shot from the right corner, but an offensive rebound by Davis goes up and scores. And the Warriors have it. And Vanderbilt slow to get up at the end of their end. Now Vanderbilt recovers. Zyslav shoots a three and got it. Or is that a long two? It's going to be two. Tried to drive, was cut off. It'll go around the perimeter. Now Roach wants to drive. He'll kick it over for Mutia Bidius. Man in his face, but he shoots the three and nailed it. Trying to get a late run here to close the gap here, the last minutes of the first half. 
Pass goes into the lane for Toscano Anderson, and he scores. Lob it over for Muti Abidias into the lane. Tries to create a shot. Couldn't quite get it. Gets his own rebound. Another tip in. Misses. Another tip in. It's good by Boston Game. Yeah, Rodriguez, not much of a rest for him. He just came out. He's back in. Thornwell is in there as well. Inside Toscano Anderson. Got position and score. 51-44. Our score is Rodriguez drives. It's kind of cut off, but he continues his dribble. He'll find Sampson on the left side. And that basket is good. There's Toscano Anderson in the lane. Good anticipation by Rodriguez to try to steal it, but the uh, Warriors get it right back. And scoring is Cunningham. Rodriguez going to fire it to Thornwell. Thornwell's up top here at the top of the key. Will drive inside and shoot, score. And look what a couple three-pointers. Mute Abidias, now Thornwell driving the lane. is cut off, finds Vanderbilt. Keepers have the lead for the first time tonight, 54-53. They've been down by as many as 11, but lead now for the first time. It's a short-lived lead as Marble drives inside and scores. The lane to Zyslav, now Pargo with it. Pargo will try to split the defense, drive up inside and score in the uh, basketball tournament so he's always seems like he's playing basketball three-pointer from the right side is good by Boykins and no doubt about that one we're tied at 57 though first minute of the third quarter Argo will shoot a three from the right side and that's nothing but net it's off to return it to marble now we're under 10 on the shot clock Argo has control Davis set a high uh, lob for him then rolls to the basket and Davis lobs it up and in Piper's down 62-57 here in the third quarter. And play getting a little ragged now as the Warriors steal it back, and they come down, and Marble scores after a Cunningham miss. Rebound attempt also misses by Boston Game, and the Warriors have it. Warriors back down to the front court. Left side three-pointer is good. Nothing but net for Marble. Oh, bounce pass inside to Harrison. Harrison will find Marble driving the lane. Nobody there in a slam dunk. Good block by the Vipers. Didn't see who got it. Might have been Vanderbilt. Vanderbilt with it now for the Vipers. Finds Muti Abidius underneath and scores. The rebound to the Warriors. Toscano Anderson picked up the rebound. Down come the Warriors on the break. Vipers are back in time. Zyslov left side three is good. Vanderbilt came down with it for the Vipers. And back they come on the break. Sampson left side. Three-pointer. Nothing but net. So they've been in a little bit of a hot streak as of late. Warriors have the basketball right now. 4.44 to go here in the third quarter. Off balance shot goes in and a whistle. Rodriguez walks it across the timeline, lobs it up, and Ali Oop. Vanderbilt with 17 points. He laid that up and in. Driving the other end is, is uh, Cunningham, or excuse me, Harrison between the circles, now toward the left side. Five seconds on the shot clock. A shot by out getting into it, chanting defense here. Shot clock down to seven. Harrison dribbles right, tries to lob it inside. It gets into the hands of uh, Toscano Anderson, or excuse me, Davis. Now will go back up top to Harrison as the shot clock now at eight. Set a high screen, Davis does, as Harrison drives inside. Little spin move in the lane and scores it up and in. Harrison trying to drive against Sampson on the left side. Now tries to the right side as they cleared out underneath for him. He's going to kick it outside left. Cunningham at three and got it. 90 to 79 lead now for Santa Cruz. Vipers racing to the front court, get it to Thornwell's hands, drives left side of the lane, has a shot blocked by Davis. 381 lead with 10 10 to go. And uh, Boykins drives the lane, little teardrop goes in. Nice touch there by Jacoby Boykins out of Louisiana Tech. Uh, Boykins uh, had a pick by Spaulding that looks to go the other way to Sampson, the left side three pointer. That's no good. Spalding, offensive rebound, goes up, scores. Yeah, and great putback. Johnson with it between the circles. They set a high pick for him as Johnson rolls to the basket. Gets the feed, but loses control, and it's stolen away by Spalding. Two on one break at the other end. Blossom game scores. Lob it over to Boykins. Now it's into the hands of uh, Blossom game at the right elbow. Drives into the lane and scores. In the G League, you only get one free throw, and it counts for two, or it can count for three if you're a foul shooting a three. 
They revert back to the old rules in the last two minutes, though. Three-point try by Marble is good. 7.35 to go in the fourth quarter. Rodriguez fires it over to Blossom Game, who drives the lane, goes up, has his shot blocked. Terrific block by Johnson, Vanderbilt. Vanderbilt will drive the lane inside. Fake left to go up with the right hand and score. Rodriguez. 24 points now for Vanderbilt. Doubles his output from last night, which was his debut as a Viper. We go over that tonight. As a pass by Vanderbilt, intended for Mute Abidius, is knocked away and stolen by Blue, and the Warriors coming down. Here's Marble going into the lane, goes up with the right hand and scores. The Vipers only eight of 30 on their three pointers. Leading scores Vanderbilt with 24 points and eight rebounds here tonight as Boykin shoots a three for the Vipers and got it. And it's 103-94 now with 6.10 to go. Cunningham will shoot a three for the Warriors, and he nails it. Cunningham got the rebound, who passed it off to Vanderblue, brings it into the uh, front court. Now to be Cunningham's ball. Straight away, three-pointer is good. And uh, Blue has it on the left side. Now will go to Cunningham. Cunningham will lob it inside for an alley-oop. That's good to Davis, who slams it home. They need a lot of points, and they need them fast as Rodriguez Dribbles to the right side, takes left, goes right, and lays it up and in. Now pass to Marble. Marble lob it into the lane for Toscano Anderson. A little turnaround, misses, gets his own rebound, goes up again, misses, a tip in, and scores. Good hustle, the right side. We get it to Mute Abidius. He'll drive the lane, he'll kick it out for Rodriguez. A little a one-hand tip pass into the lane to Roach, who finds Mute Abidius and scores. Mute Abidius with 13. 115-102, Warriors. We're under two minutes to play, though. Driving into the lane is Marble. Marble drives up and dunks it. Marble's going to hand off to Pargo. Pargo between the circles. We'll find Harrison on the right side. Guarded by Rodriguez. They set a uh, pick and roll as uh, Toscano Anderson goes up and dunks it. 107 to play as Rodriguez. Races up the right side, then is cut off. Now tries it again at the baseline. Finds Blossom game in the lane, and is able to drift it in and score with 17 points for him. Or just a violation, actually, so it'd be Vipers will inbound it. The Rodriguez straightaway three-pointer is good. Nothing but net for him, and he's really kind of come alive here in this fourth quarter. Reese with it for the Warriors in the front court. Warriors up by 12. 30 seconds left. Reese drives left side of the lane, shoots, scores. And count the basket, a chance for a three-point play. And scores, and he has a chance for a three-point play. And Santa Cruz has been trying to do this all night against Rodriguez. They've been... Santa Cruz and Rio Grande Valley. Reese up the top between the circles. Wastes a shot clock to drift down to four and then shoots and nails a three. Defense uh, sitting back. In the last three seconds will drift off here. And that'll be the game. 126-109 is going to be our final score. Yeah, yeah. Chicane.